finding the order of a uh, reaction of a rate. Finding rate order. So we have, let's say, the reaction A is consumed and uh, we can write the general rate equation as rate equals minus, because we have a consumption, rate constant times concentration of A to the power of M. And uh, M is our rate order, and that is what we want to find. So how can we do that? We can say instead of rate here, we can write the speed of the reaction. And the reason why we can do that is because speed has no direction, and therefore we get rid of this negative sign here. So the speed of the reaction would be K times a to the power of m and now we can uh, log both sides and we get log speed equals log k that is our rate constant and the times uh, in under rules of logarithm turns into a plus sign plus m times log of the concentration of A. And what we have here is the equation for a straight line, y equals c plus mx. And this part here is c, and this part here is our x. So what we can do now is um, we can uh, let me write this down here again. Log speed equals m log a plus log k. So we can now determine graphically our rate constant. So on the y-axis we would plot log speed. On the x-axis we plot log of the concentration of A and hopefully we would get a straight line. This point here indicates log k and the gradient of this line this indicates m and that is our rate order. So um, what we can do is we just simply measure the speed. So we measure speed of a reaction uh, independence of A. as a function of a function of a of the concentration a so we have a1 a2 a3 and we will get speed 1 speed 2 and so on and this is then what we plot on our graph log speed versus log a. I hope this makes sense and thank you for watching.